This is Joseph Drust, and welcome back to another episode of Ask ZBrush. So we had a question sent in asking, how can I dock multiple palettes to the left tray and have them open at the same time? So to start off, I have ZBrush loaded up, and I just have an example model here loaded in. So this is just a chain object here that I want to use to create a IMM triparts curve brush. So the question is asking about docking multiple palettes to the left tray and having them open at the same time. So first, let's just talk about the trays inside of ZBrush. So inside of ZBrush, if you hover to the left side over here, you'll see you're going to get this highlighted divider here. And if you double click on this, this is going to open up the left tray. So just like the right tray that's over here where the tool palette lives, you can now have the ability to have a left tray. Now with this left tray, what you can do is you can come to the top here and you can open up any of these palettes and then you can click and drag this little icon here and you can dock these palettes to the side. So I just took that stroke palette and then just docked it to the left tray here. So now instead of going up to the top and opening up stroke to change the different properties here, I can now just navigate to the left side over here and change them this way. So using these trays allows you to have better visibility on the palettes that are located at the top. So with the mesh that I have loaded here, I want to create an IMM curve parts brush. And to do this, I would need to go into the brush palette, which is currently open here, and then also the stroke palette. Now you'll notice I have both of these docked to the left tray over here, but if I try to open up the brush palette and the stroke palette at the same time, it's not going to be possible. So if I try to open brush, you can see that the stroke palette is going to automatically collapse. And then if I open stroke, you'll see the brush palette is going to automatically collapse. So what I want is I want both of these palettes open at the same time so that I can quickly come over here, scroll to the modifiers I want to change, and then update them as fast as possible. So by default, ZBrush is only going to allow you to have one palette open at a time in the left tray. However, there is a preference that will allow you to modify this functionality. So I'm going to navigate up here to the Preferences tab at the top here and open this up. And then I'm going to locate the Interface area. And then inside the Interface area, I want to go to Palettes. And then in here, you have a left tray and a right tray button. Now, when either of these buttons are enabled, it's only going to allow you to have one palette expanded at a single time. So you can see the left tray option is currently enabled. So when I try to open up multiple palettes in the left tray, it's only going to open one at a time. So what I want to do is I want to toggle this off. So just turn this left tray option off. And now if I come to the left tray over here and open up the brush palette, you can see that the brush palette has now opened. And if I scroll down, you can see that the stroke palette has stayed open. So now I have both these palettes open at the same time. So now with both these palettes open, I can now navigate to their different areas. So say for the create option here, I want to open this up and I want to just do a create insert mesh here to create a new insert mesh from the subtool I've selected. I'm just going to click new to that. And now I just want to scroll down to the stroke area. I'm going to open up the curve area here and activate curve mode. And now I'm going to go back to the brush palette. I'm going to locate the modifiers area. In this modifiers area, I want to make sure I turn on weld points and stretch, maybe up my curve resolution and my max bend angle. And now I can select a new tool, say like the sphere 3D object here, make it a poly mesh. Now with this brush selected, I increase my draw size a little bit, and now I can drag this out. And now I have that curve brush created. So once again, to recap, if you would like to have multiple palettes open in the left tray, you want to make sure you go to the Preferences tab at the top here, go to the Interface area, and then make sure you have the left tray option here disabled. If this left tray option is enabled, it's only going to allow you to have one palette open at a time in the left tray. So if you have any other questions related to ZBrush pipelines or processes, please use the hashtag AskZBrush on Twitter. Happy ZBrushing.